so today we'll be dealing with medical coding anatomy interview question part 2 okay so in this series we will be discussing nearly 10 questions which is given with options so you can give your right answer in the comment box so this these are the questions which are frequently asked in the assessment during the interview session now we will be moving on to the questions which are frequently asked so the first question is which of the following is not a type of muscle tissue option a skeletal b cardiac c epithelial and d smooth i'll repeat it again which of the following is not a type of muscle tissue a skeletal b cardiac c epithelial d smooth give your answer in the comment box so now we will be moving on with the second question of this interview series so the second question is the femur is a bone found in which part of the body option a arm b leg c spine d skull i'll repeat the question the femur is a bone found in which part of the body a arm b leg c spine and d skull please give your right answer in the comment box next we will be moving on to the third question of this interview series so the third question is which organ is responsible for filtering waste product from the blood and producing urine option a liver b kidney c pancreas d stomach I'll repeat the question. Which organ is responsible for filtering waste product from the blood and producing urine? A. Liver. B. Kidney. C. Pancreas. And D. Stomach. Please give your right answer in the comment box. Next, we will be moving on with the fourth question of this interview series. So, the fourth question is, the central nervous system consists of which two main components? Option A is brain and spinal cord, B is brain and peripheral nerves, C is spinal cord and peripheral nerves, D is brain stem and spinal cord. So, I will repeat the question. The central nervous system consists of which two main components? A is brain and spinal cord. B is brain and peripheral nerves. C is spinal cord and peripheral nerves. D is brain stem and spinal cord. So, this is also an important question. Give your answer in the comment box. Next is question number 5. The trachea is commonly known as a windpipe b footpipe c esophagus d bronchus i'll repeat the question the trachea is commonly known as a windpipe b footpipe c esophagus d bronchus give your right answer in the comment box so the next question of this interview series is Which of the following is not a major blood vessel of the heart? A is iota, B is pulmonary artery, C is pulmonary vein, D is inferior vena cava. I will repeat the question. Which of the following is not a major blood vessel of the heart? A is iota, B is pulmonary artery, C is pulmonary vein and D is inferior vena cava. Please go through the question properly and give your right answer in the comment box. So next we will be moving on with the seventh question. The pharynx is a shared passageway for which two system in the body? A is digestive and respiratory. B is respiratory and circulatory. C is circulatory and nervous, D is endocrine and digestive. I will repeat the question. The pharynx is a shared passageway for which two system in the body? 
A is digestive and respiratory, B is respiratory and circulatory, C is circulatory and nervous, D is endocrine and digestive. So next question is which of the following bone is not a part of the axial skeleton? A is scapula, B is skull, C is ribcage, D is vertebral column. I'll repeat the question. Which of the following bones is not a part of the axial skeleton? A is scapula, B is skull, C is ribcage and D is vertebral column. Now we will be moving on with the next question. So the next question is the largest organ in the human body is a liver b skin c brain d heart i'll repeat the question the largest organ in the human body is a liver b skin c brain d heart give your right answer in the comment box So the last question of interview series is question number 10. The process of bone formation known as A. Ossification, B. Calcification, C. Resorption and D. Hematopoiesis. I will repeat the question. The process of bone formation is known as A. Ossification, B. Calcification, C. Resorption and D. Hematopoiesis. Please answer all the question in the comment box. We will catch up in the next part 3 anatomy interview questions. So here we will be discussing nearly 100 questions. So I will post totally part 10. Okay. So thank you for watching this video.